At a private school, each first year student is sorted into one of four houses. If four students are randomly selected from 15 available students, what is the probability that they are the four youngest students? This problem seems to be pretty tough. Let's try it. So we want the probability that we select the four youngest. Okay, so we know that that is going to be the number of ways to select the four youngest divided by the number of ways to select four people. So we have 15 students total, okay, and we're selecting four, okay. So here n is equal to 15 and r is equal to 4, okay. So in the bottom we have to have the total number of ways to select four people from a group of 15. The order does not matter, so this is going to be a combinations problem. So it will be 15, choose 4. So in StackCrunch, the command for that is comb 15, 4. So we go to question help, we go to StackCrunch, and to access combinations, you go to data, compute, and expression. Okay, data, compute, and expression, and it's comb 15, comma, 4. All right, that's going to be 1,365. 1,365. That is the number of ways, whoops, five. <laughs> that is the number of ways to select four people from a group of 15. Up top, we want to select the four youngest from a group of 15. Well, there's only one way to select the four youngest. You select the four youngest, so one. You might say, what, well, doesn't make any sense. Another way to think about it. You take the four youngest, and you choose all four of them. That's also equal to one. You could try it in StatCrunch, right? You take the four youngest, and you choose the four youngest. Data, compute, expression, comb, four, four. So one way to choose the four youngest. That still doesn't make sense. Try to visualize it. Let's say you have a bunch of people here. Um, so a person here, a person here, a person here, a person here. These are the four youngest, then you have everyone else here. So if you're going to pick the four youngest, maybe you'll pick this one first, and this one second, this one third, this one fourth. Okay, you've picked the four youngest. But if you pick this one first, and this one second, and this one third, and this one fourth, it's the same thing. You've still picked the four youngest. So it doesn't matter which one gets picked first. To pick the four youngest, you have to pick all four youngest. So there's only one way to pick the four youngest and 1,365 ways to pick four people. So the answer is 1 over 1,365. Kind of a side note, this first sentence was completely useless. <laughs> At a private school, each first year student is sorted into one of four houses. Uh, that was not helpful um, at all in the question.